We are trying to teach Layla Jane how to ride a bicycle. I'm telling you guys, this girl is gonna be a musician or some type of artist. from Hey Mamas and today we are trying to teach Layla Jane how to ride a bicycle. Not a bicycle, well, with training wheels. We have tried putting her on a tricycle, on some of those push tricycles, but she doesn't know how to pedal. So we have been researching how to teach your child to pedal and Brian thinks he found a solution. So I'm kind of letting him take charge of this and see if daddy can figure out how to teach this girl how to pedal. Ah, okay. So then, okay, so we put books under the training wheel. So then this will just, oh, keep the book there. I think daddy wants it there. Because she doesn't know how to like push with her feet. Well, this so this, this since it's like, it'll make it like a stationary bike. So she can just practice pedaling and getting that movement down maybe. We'll see. By the way, she got this tricycle. Her and Brian went out one day to go somewhere. They come walking in with this huge bicycle. I couldn't believe it. That's such a, such a dad thing to do. Buys his little girl anything she wants. And this will be a good book. Ah! Not just a good dad, I'm the a great husband The exemplary husband. <laughs> a typical dad ride with a little girl. Anything she wants, he came from home with it. And so she can't even ride a tricycle. Okay, right, okay. Yet, he thinks she can ride this. Focus, okay? I have my okay. doubts on whether dance. she'll still okay, be able to do so the training wheels, years. but I'm hopeful. Brian just turned on Bicycle by Queen for Layla to have on in the background. This is your pedal song, girl. Do you want to ride your bike? Look at That's going to be you. When you move this foot backwards, here are the tires. <gasps> keep pedal, keep doing that. You, you keep doing that backwards. movement. Here, don't worry about the handlebars. Daddy's got them. You, you just keep on. moving those leggies. Now, see how this one's down? When this one's there, push that one there. See? Ooh. Push his foot down. Good job. You can stand up. Keep going, honey. Yeah. Yeah. Keep going, keep going, because then when you keep going, the bike will go. Oh, oh, you're getting there, you're getting there. Keep pushing down. Keep pushing. <laughs> Red Hot Chili Peppers, I know. Keep going. She's sitting here naming what songs are coming on instead That's of pedaling. Well, <laughs> I think this girl's going to be more go, of like a musician way. artist more than athletic, maybe. I think this is a great idea. This is going to get her used to pedaling, but I don't think she's going to get it just in one setting. This is something we're going to have to practice like every day until she finally gets the movement down. She doesn't really know how to move her legs, right? Let's try going up and down on the pedals again, but this time you're going to do it by yourself. Here, put on here. Okay. I'm gonna give you momentum. Now keep pedaling. Keep pedaling, move your legs. Keep pedaling, keep pedaling. Keep moving your legs. Oh, yeah, girl, yeah. you did one! Go, go, go. You did one pedal! Then you push this one down. So when one is up, the other goes oh, down. Oh, Jax. Jax! Okay, now steer, steer. Steer towards mommy. Steer towards mommy. Move Ready the handlebars. Okay. Oh, you want lovey in there? All right, sidetracked, sidetracked. All right, so we definitely need a little bit more practice with this. Okay. But I think we're onto something here. She did one pedal, and I'll take that for her first day of trying this. Go, 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 go! Yes! Yes! Good job! So like this making a stationary bike out of books, Brian is always very creative when it comes to parenting Layla Jane and getting her to do difficult things. For instance, getting her to eat. He has come up with a really cute way of getting her to eat her food. And I, as you know, if you've watched our vlogs, we have struggled to get her to eat anything besides junk food. And his method actually has been working pretty well. So I'm really excited to show you all that and see, and show you all how he gets her to eat, a picky eater to eat her dinner. And then also later on, I know Layla Jane and many toddlers hate wrapping their teeth brush or hate brushing their teeth. Well, Brian figured out a fun way to get her to brush her teeth and it's super cute so I can't wait to show you guys both of these things. It is almost dinner time and tonight we are having barbecue chicken, 
some potatoes that I'm making in my air fryer that I just got and I absolutely love it and just a salad and I can't wait for you guys to see how Brian gets her to eat. Are you ready to chow? Oh. So Brian's technique is every time she takes a bite or he's trying to get her to take a bite, he says her muscles get bigger. And he really exaggerates it and gets super excited that he can see her arm muscles getting bigger. He makes her flex her muscles. And he says she's gonna run faster, jump higher, and he just really plays into it. And it's super cute, she loves it, and she just eats it up. Can we cheers? Let's cheers! Get some muscles. Say muscles. Cheers to muscles. Oh, look stab it. Stab it. I had a big look bite. Look at daddy's muscle. Mmm. Lil, let me see your muscle. That's a big one. Wow. Good job. Are you gonna eat more chicken? Oh my gosh. Let me see that arm muscle now. What? Go raw. Let's eat more. What? Mm. Good save. Did you just get taller? Mommy, look at it. Whoa! So it's so cute. I first discovered that Brian was doing this with her when I was gone for dinner one night with some friends and I came home and he said she ate everything. And all of a sudden Layla started talking to me about how big her muscles are. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is genius. It works every time. I'm telling you, she loves this and it gets her to eat. You gotta try it with your kids. It's awesome. Jack says, I want some chicken to get some bigger muscles. <laughs> Sorry, Jack. <laughs> Ooh, I feel fast. I got energy now. Do you feel fast? How fast do you feel? Really fast? And muscles? Whoa. Whoa. Do you see how tall daddy got from eating a salad? Look at that. And look at his muscles. Here, pick a piece of, le of lettuce, anyone you want. Anyone you want. You're gonna get so, so tall and strong. I'm when you're done with that, you get to pick any piece of lettuce you want, okay? That know. one, that piece of lettuce. Oh, they give you a little bit, a little oh, bit. Oh, it's a little bit of muscle and tall. Look what happens when you have a big green But look what it eats, happens when you eat gr big one. Whoa! Mom, eat the stems. It's okay, you can eat the stems on that, it's okay. Here, let's find one without a stem. That has no stem on it, try that one. Wait, cheers me. Cheers, good job. <gasps> Whoa, keep eating it, I saw you getting taller. Whoa. No way, you did a great job. That was awesome, Layla, look how strong, okay, show me your muscles. Yeah, let's see your muscles. I want to see those muscles. Here, I'll take your plate for you. Thank you. Whoa! Oh, can we get them raw? Oh, yeah! I know! Oh, do you see daddy's muscles? Oh, yeah! Look at my muscles! Yeah! Wow! Smaller. What? Oh, mommies are small now? My, I ate my dinner! My muscles are big! I don't know. I think yours are bigger. Well, you maybe yours are bigger now. Can we see how fast you can run now? I want to see how fast you can well, run show now. Show us how fast you're running now. Oh my god. Whoa! Do it again. Run back this way now. Whoa! Whoa! I'm telling you, if you guys have a toddler that refuses to eat, just make a big deal over how big their muscles are getting, how tall they're getting, and how fast they're gonna run if they eat each bite. Hey Layla, what are you guys doing? <clears throat> You're opening the good tars and saying good night to them all? Oh, okay, Brian. We can't do this every night because this is what? complex. Daddy has a lot. <laughs> okay. So I just walked in here and they're opening up all of Brian's guitars and saying good night to all of them. That's according to Layla Jane. Brian is actually gonna be cleaning them all tonight, but Layla Jane thinks this is all just for her. 
and we're just gonna be saying goodnight to every guitar tonight. Layla, what do you think of all these guitars? Not Layla. Oh, she went right for that one. Oh, Daddy's so proud. I'm telling you guys, this girl is gonna be a musician or some type of artist. She loves her music. Daddy bought this one when Mommy and Daddy lived in Chicago. Strum it. Wanna strum it? It's Bob Dylan, which has got, who got me into music. It's out of tune. You like it? It's so cute. You like it's so cute. You like it? It does, you're so smart. Is it that guitar will always mean so much to us because we got that for the short year we lived in Chicago. Right after we got married, we lived in Chicago for a year. You wanna say night night? Well, you gotta strum it first. Come here, come strum. Strum it and then say good night to the guitar. This is one of daddy's favorites. Now, who are we listening to? so awesome. Oh my goodness, daddy's little girl. Okay, are we saying goodnight to this one now? I'm gonna let them have their daddy-daughter time while I go get a few things done before bedtime. All right, next thing is brushing of the teeth. First thing I recommend are these Sonic toothbrushes. These are awesome. They just bite down on this and then you press a button and it vibrates and they just have to hold their mouth shut. We were having a trouble yeah. keeping her mouth shut the entire time it was running. So Brian came up with having a staring competition during it and it works. Like I swear, Brian has the most creative, fun ideas and they all work. Now I'm gonna beat you tonight. Staring competition. Oh. Yeah. oh. You and me. Oh. Ah! Well, there you have it. She actually brushed her teeth through two cycles there. She did a steering competition with Brian and then one with me. So I'm telling you, try these methods. If, if you have a kid that struggles with eating, brushing their teeth, or if you're trying to teach them how to pedal a bicycle, these are seeming to work for us. I would love to hear it too if you all try these with your kids at home. Please leave a message in the comments below. I love reading them. Thanks again so much for watching. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and follow us on Instagram at KMamas18. Bye everyone.